Hello friends and welcome back. Today I'm going to do another plan with me using one of my own hand-drawn kits. This one is called Hello Fall and this one features my own little marshmallowy family here. Caitlin calls her a bunny rabbit but she is not a bunny rabbit. Her name is Pip, that is the girl. The boy's name is Frankie and their dog's name is Morty. I'm also going to be using this pumpkin spice from uh, Punky Bee and those are the different paint swatches and I really really love those. I talked about them in another video and I am definitely going to be stocking up on those during the Black Friday sale. So first off I'm going to start by telling you what planner this is. This is my ANN 7x9 planner and that is Avalon and Ninth if you're not familiar with what ANN is and this is right now my shop planner until the end of October and then I'll be switching out this one will be my home family planner and then my TPC hybrid will be the shop planner so I'm going to kind of do a little swippy swap on them for the month of November because I need a little more space to plan out my kits and since I'm doing a lot of my own designs I need more um, idea space I guess, and I can still make it cute by putting stickers on it, just like I do now for the daily stuff. I really haven't been doing much in the way of memory memory keeping in there, so I thought it would be better served as the shop planner so that I have a place to actually write down everything that I'm trying to figure out to do for that week, that day, that month, wherever I happen to be at. So anyway, let's get back to this one. So all of these little characters for this kit, I thought it would be kind of fun to do like a fall bucket slash to-do list kind of a kit. So I wanted things, every everything from cozy reading in a big old overstuffed chair to um, right up there in the corner we've got a coffee day and you've got like the fall leaves in the background and they're wearing their fall sweaters it's a nice, nice little um, coffee shop date kind of a thing and then as we get through to the other ones I'll kind of explain where they came from there is also matching uh, doodle icons for this so there's full sheets of each one of these ones so coffee date all of those are on their own little little icons so those are also up in the shop if you're feeling like you need to mark those with anything cute um hopefully you think it's cute <laughs> I think they're cute I like them a lot Caitlin I she for whatever reason she thinks that that's a bunny rabbit I don't know what her bunny rabbits have three ears my bunny rabbits and my where I live don't have three ears so I I'm not sure where that comes from, but <laughs> she does kind of, I don't know, maybe it's because of that. That's supposed to be hair. You know, like um, when I was trying her the first time, the first thing I thought of when I put that on her for hair and I colored her all in, I put her cute little rosy cheeks on her. I'm like, she looks like a marshmallow version of like Lisa Simpson <laughs> with, the, with the weird hair. So I don't know. Anyway, I think she's adorable. So I have there, um, the top of that box is like work from home and it's got some fall elements to it. So it looks like you're sitting there like planning at your fall desk or working at your computer and you've got it all decorated for fall. The one in the bottom there is going for a walk. So they're taking Morty out for a walk on a nice beautiful fall day. Got the leaves swirling around them. This one here is a fall planning board. I don't know if you guys have ever used one of those, but I actually have one in my office and I love it. I decorate the crap out of it, but I actually turned it into like a pin board slash everything kind of a board so it's got a ton and ton and ton of stuff on it but anyway that is for fall planning and see what did I do also like I said I've got some little the little icons that denote all of these so if you have anything on here that you're needing to mark in your planner for fall it'll be here I'm not sure why I walked away because now the video is just kind of sitting here oh I know why I had to go get my cutter that's why anyway um so now I'm just going to kind of start putting all this stuff down and I lost my train of thought because of that big old pause there. These um, paint swatches are, like I said, they're from Punky Bee. I'll leave them linked below because I don't use anybody else's stuff. So I'll leave the planner below and I'll leave Punky Bee stuff below. So that way you can find it. But um, those paint swatches are like, uh, I must have them for my stash because they are great space fillers for us no white space planners and they're even great for space fillers if you're not a no white space they're just good to put your script right in the middle of that and it looks perfect because that's usually what I do I actually one of the things that I do as a shop owner that I know a lot of other shops do for you like you can have custom scripts made but I do a lot of my stuff that's like every day that I do all the time 
I have scripts and I make them so that I don't have to write it out because I hate my handwriting. So, and those little paint swatches are really good places for you to throw down your scripts. So if you have something planned for right there, like laundry day or whatever, actually, I think that's what is there. Nope. That's, what did I put on that? I'm looking at the planner right now because actually today is the 21st. So this planner is from the 18th to the 24th. So I've already written in the first three days. And that particular one, it was to post a plan with me video. So that was my last plan with me video with Tilly B plan. So that is what went into that little spot there. But I, I put things like um, laundry day, meal prep, you know, I have all that kind of stuff in there. So I have scripts for all that. I don't have to see my ugly handwriting. So the rest of the boxes, uh, let me explain them all. So, oh, you can see down at the bottom the little cozy reading. So that's just a cute, it's much smaller on the sheet for if you're getting them as like icons. But it's a nice big overstuffed chair and she's reading her book in it. And then there's also a whole box with it off to the side if you get the kit. So the top one there is just TV time. That's what it's called. They're just sitting there at home. You can see I've got like the fall picture over the top. And I was like, what makes a bookshelf look like? fall they just stick a pumpkin on it <laughs> and so that looks like fall but they got their warm cozy little blanket on and they're all sitting there watching tv together as a family and then you've got frankie is raking the leaves so pip is making him do yard work um then pip is reading her book and i drew her a little table with a lamp and a little plant on it next to it that was look really cute and then you've got apple picking at the top and then you've got lazy days at the bottom which is Frankie and Morty and taking a nap after Pip was slaving him outside in the yard raking leaves all day. So that is, I think, all of the boxes that I drew. Pretty sure. Yep, I'm looking at them all. Those are all the boxes. And then there's all the doodles that go with it. So each one of those has its own little doodle to go with it. So if you need that, that's where you can find it. Uh, what else can I tell you about this? So I'm just putting everything, like I said, this is my home planner this month. It will not be. I mean, this is my work planner this month. It will not be next month, which is why I don't have a lot of cool stuff in it. This, I'm looking at it to try to tell you what the heck I did this week. And so far, it's just a whole lot of work stuff. Um, little side note is if you are not a part of the Facebook group, I know I talk about it all the time. You guys are probably tired of it. But the reveal video for the November monthly, what do I call it? <laughs> Magical monthly it's like a tongue twister every month i didn't come up with the name my pr girls came up with the name and their car is just the cutest little thing ever but it is like a total tongue twister for me magical monthly mystery bundle i think that might not be right i might have some of the m words mixed up anyway that reveal video for facebook group only goes up on friday so if you want to see what is going to be in next month's reveal for the next month's monthly bundle um, that is where you're going to see it first. It will end up on YouTube later in the week, but if you're like dying to see what's coming out in the new foil and it is fantastic, I can just tell you right now, it is fantastic. Um, go check out that video over on the Facebook group. All you got to do is hop over there. Link is below this video as always, and just answer a couple questions, let you in, and we just do that to keep the bots out. So if that is something that you're really, really wanting to see, that is where you're going to see it. So I'm just going to put up the dates and then I am pretty much done. I know I'm just babbling on about nothing in particular, but I just wanted to show you this kit because I was really proud of my little doodles here and I think my little family's adorable. So anyway, that is everything and thanks so much for stopping by. I really, really appreciate it. I hope you guys have a fantastic day and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye.